Today I'm going to show you the new edge lighting plus features for your Samsung Galaxy phone. Let's get started. Hey everybody, welcome to Tech with Brett, where I help tech work for you. And if you have previously watched this channel, most likely you have seen my edge lighting tutorial. So today I'm going to show you a new enhancement that Samsung has released that allows you to have more edge lighting features. So to get this, you do need to head into the Galaxy App Store and search for edge lighting. So you will want to download the Edge Lighting Plus right here. Now Edge Lighting Plus is a part of the Good Lock family of applications that was released a few weeks ago. And so if you want to get this, you do need to have a Galaxy S8, S8 Plus, S9, S9 Plus, or a Note 8. And if for some reason you are not able to download this or you cannot find this, in the Galaxy App Store, that's because your country is currently not supported. So to enable this, I will leave a link in the description of how you can actually download it and hopefully it will work with an APK and side loading it. So let me know if you have any problems there, we'll try and figure it out. But once you go into the application, it takes you right into the edge lighting settings. So if we go into the effect here, we do have a few options that we have previously seen. So we already saw basic, multicolor, glow and glitter. Those were all added with the Oreo update on the Galaxy S8 and on the S9. But if we go over here, we have a few more options. So now we have Fluid, Boomerang, Galaxy, Loop, and Celebrate. So we're just gonna go through these one by one and check them out. So when we open up Fluid, you can see that it's just one single line that wraps around the entire edge of the display. So if you haven't already, make sure you go into the width setting and set it all the way to wide to see it the most. And then here, change the transparency and make sure that it is on the lowest setting so you can see that all the way. And then here you do have the option to choose what color is going to show up. So here you could choose a specific color that will always show. So in this video, we're going to select green because that just happens to be the best color to see when doing this. But you could have it choose an app color. So depending on the app, it could show a specific color or you could actually just choose your own color right there. So that's the fluid effect. Let's go to the boomerang. This one's pretty cool as it will change and go back and forth around the outside edge. Again, let's try going into the green here to see what that looks like. And now we're gonna go to the galaxy effect. So this one's kind of cool. It leaves this little trail around the outside, kind of sparkly, a little bubbly. You do have the color and the transparency options as well. And then here we have the loop option where it will just loop around the device. And then lastly, we have the celebrate. And here you can see the sparkles that show up around the outside of the device. Now here, there is no different color effect. It will just be the one color of the celebrate option. If you've never used edge lighting before, you can check out my video in the pop-up on the screen to see more details there. But when you do download the Edge Lighting Plus app, it actually gives you an app so you can instantly open up the edge lighting settings. Now, if you wanna go into the settings of the phone, just go into the notification bar, select settings, go down to display, and then here you will find the edge screen and here you have the edge lighting option. So then you will go in here and there you can choose to have it show when the screen is on, when the screen is off or both. And then here you have the edge lighting style. Now I do wanna mention if you're using this, this will not work in certain applications. So you will not receive Gmail notifications like this. You will not receive Messenger from Facebook notifications and WhatsApp you will not receive unless you go into WhatsApp and actually enable the pop-up notification. So I've explained that before in a video, but I did want to mention it here. So that is how you go into here and you can adjust the settings. So let's see what it looks like when the lights are off. A neat trick is that when you are in this menu, you can swipe down in the middle of the screen and it will hide the little bar at the bottom. So you will be able to see the full effect without having to apply it to the screen.
Now when you do get one of these notifications, you can tap on the pop-up or you can swipe down on the Galaxy S9 and it will go right into your messaging application here in the pop-up or you tap on it and it would open in the full screen option. And that's about it for the Edge Lighting Plus application. If you guys have any further questions about how this app works, or if you'd like to know more about GoodLock, let me know in the comments below. Some of my buddies like Jimmy is Promo and TK Bay have already made some awesome videos about that. If you would like to see more videos all about the Galaxy S9 and the Edge Lighting, make sure you click the playlist on screen. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one.